good reason for dragging us down here, Harold. Well, I'm afraid Fiona isn't really warming up to Prince Charming. Um, FYI, not my fault. Well, no, of course it's not, dear. I mean, how charming can I be when I have to pretend I'm that dreadful ogre? No, no, it's only fault. Um, perhaps it's best if we just call the whole thing off. Okay. What? what? I mean, you can't force someone to fall in love. <laughs> I beg to differ. I do it all the time. Have Fiona drink this, and she'll fall in love with the first man she kisses, which will be charming. Uh, no. What did you say? I, I, I can't. I, I won't do it. Oh, yes, you will. If you remember, I helped you with your happily ever after, and I can take it away just as easily. Is that what you want? Is it? Mm, no. Good boy. Now. We have to go. I need to do Charming's hair before the ball. <laughs> he's hopeless. You know, he's all high in the front. You can never get to the back. You always need someone to do the back of your hair. Oh, thank you, Mother. Mother! Um, uh, Mary, a talking horse! The ogre!